Hello everybody, Robbie here with my writing haul for the week of March 3rd to the 9th of 2024. Hope you guys are in a great day. Today is March 6th, 2024, and today is Senior Day or Wellness Wednesday. So card holders that are 65 plus, they'll be getting um, five times the rewards points. So that was the only incentive. And um, I did actually two transactions on my grandfather's card today. So I wanted to see how it was, you know, still working out. I think these are decent deals, but it's not all that amazing or anything like that. I tried to make it the best I can, but you know, I still ended up paying too much money, which uh, it wasn't supposed to happen. But whatever happened, happened. I had a lot of bonus cash coming in. Uh, obviously, I had the, what do you call it? The bonus cash challenges from January to February. It just came in on March 5th. So check your accounts. I was shorted a bunch of money on two of my accounts. So one of my accounts, I didn't. I was supposed to get 10 more dollars than what was you know listed in the email. Uh, so I had contacted customer care already and um, they had to somehow give it back to me because, you know, I bought the Revlon for that reason um, two weeks ago. And then something that I purchased in January that still wasn't added into the bonus cash challenges list for some reason. So my nail polish that I purchased back in January for the Sally Hansen that I purchased for buy two get four dollars, that didn't get credited as well. So I'm kind of out four dollars from that. Um, yeah, so I need to get my you know, bonus cash challenge money, and I'll be happy once I get that money. Um, I mean, these are still decent deals if you're going to be, you know, rolling your rewards or you're going to be reselling or something like that. I mean, I'm going to have to resell those swap in order to pay for this this nonsense that happened, but I think we'll still make it work. So let me talk about what I did for this first transaction, uh, which is the Fiji water and the eight swap bottles. So, okay, I don't know what to say about the swap deal. It's buy two, get four dollars in bonus cash back. All right, it's a limit of four offers per card. Now this week it is buy one get one fifty percent off. So, yeah, I'm thinking that this is a monthly deal because it's also advertised in a future ad, um, based on what my underscore ra underscore deals posted. Uh, she posted the previews already for the next two weeks. So I think I saw the swap advertised again. Now I don't know uh, if it's a different deal. It's probably not. It's probably going to be a monthly deal. That's what I think. But you know, I just decided to do it on my grandfather's card because I actually wanted to do uh, the online buy online and pick up in store offer so this week there is 20 percent off uh your 30 dollar plus buy online pick up in store order so i want to try that out and i first i added the eight swap and i did all this in the store by the way because you know i'm not going to deal with no stock issues and substitutions and all that nonsense so i just did everything while i was in the store so the suave I, what was it online i can't remember i think it was 329 online and you know the it counts 329 for each item, okay? And then it's gonna be buy one, get one 50% off, so they'll take it off as a discount. So, uh, I don't know, whatever half of $3.29 is, that will come off in the discount portion, all right? So, whatever, it was great. So, yeah, 329, so it counted eight bottles at 329, all right? And I think then it told me that I was like 68 cents away from getting the $30 mark uh, in order to use that buy online and pick up in-store um, promo code. So I just added the two Fiji waters. Uh, that one <clears throat> online, it was I think 239 each and these are the 700 milliliters. So 239 each. And yeah, that's what I did. And I added that to the basket and I was able to get over the $30 mark. And then I got the discount for the Suave and then I also got the discount for the buy online pickup in store. So that was great. So basically I got back the uh, 165 discount for the four bottles as well as the $6 for buying, you know, $30 plus worth of items. And since it counted before the discount, the $30, I was, you know, really excited about that because, you know, that worked out in my favor. So I had to just buy less items and I get a bigger discount, I guess. That's pretty good. Now, when I went to the store, um, you know, it, it no first actually when i was doing the order it charged my credit card for the pre-authorized amount for whatever it was i think it was twenty dollars and 66 cents yeah i thought i had to pay the dollar five of my tax extra with the credit card and i was like oh my god this is gonna be a big cost but i'm glad that the tax was also covered in the bonus cash that's pretty good anyway um yeah so i went through the process it asked me for the credit card i obviously i, I had to put a pick up person as me because you know my grandfather can't go pick it up i had to go pick it up so i just made sure i put my name there i mean they already know me so it's not like <laughs> they're not gonna you know they're, they already know me so it's okay and yeah i paid with a credit card and then you know went about my day and then i went to the store i they scanned like their the pickup barcode uh there's like a real receipt paper with it and the cashier scanned it and you know it came up on the screen to you know use my bonus cash or whatever and uh it went through so i paid the 1961 uh before my tax 
uh, and then you know one dollar and five cents in tax it made it twenty dollars and sixty six cents. That's what I paid in bonus cash, and I got back sixteen dollars in bonus cash. So four dollars for buying two swab times four. All right, so that's great. And then I got back two dollars and forty nine cents from Ibotta for buying the two Fiji. So. 700 milliliters uh so yeah that's great so i got back two dollars and 49 cents for that so my total back was 18 dollars and 49 cents so it is a cost of like two dollars or so but um i earned 981 points as opposed to getting 196 points because obviously it's five times the points um technically i'm gonna convert the 981 that i have i'm gonna count it as two dollars <laughs> because i can so you know when you have a thousand Righty rewards points, you can convert that into bonus cash. That's equivalent to $2 in bonus cash. So basically, uh, I kind of just rolled all my money. So I guess I kind of made out. Now, when you get the receipt, all the prices are very weird. Um, so whatever the discount that I had, like $11 in discount, uh, is split up between all 10 of these items. So that's the reason that it looks very weird and odd on the receipt. But I'm very happy that I was still able to do this, you know, pick up in store order. You know, I normally don't do these things, but, you know, as long as I, you know, this is a great time to learn it anyway because they're offering so many discounts. The last few weeks they've been offering so many discounts, so I wanted to try it out and see how it worked. And it did work on my favor. So basically this ended up being free just because I had the variety of rewards points that I earned from my grandfather's card. So that was pretty great. Alright, so try it if you want to. I think this is a monthly deal, um, but you know, we'll see. Now moving on to this behemoth here. Um, my friend on my way to coupon... O-M-W-T-O... Q P O N. She told me actually about the uh, hair color clearance. Uh, we've been chatting about it for about two weeks now, and you know, I was like, you know what? When we get the coupons, it'll be much better. And uh, everything worked out so awesome. So I want to thank her again for sharing the, you know, the hair color clearance with me. So the Feria that you guys can see on this side, the L'Oreal, uh, it was like fourteen forty nine regular price, and it's on clearance for three dollars and sixty two cents. And I had a six dollar off two paper coupon, and that you know makes it sixty two cents each. I mean, that's a great little filler right there. Um, you know, if you can get it next week, you know when we have that earn bonus cash coupon, that's a great filler item. You know, cheap filler. And then this Clairol is another cheap filler. So these are actually nine eighty nine regularly or two forty nine on clearance, and we have five dollar off two paper coupon uh, that you can use. So that will make that free. You cannot use a load to car coupon because the load to car coupon exceeds the cost of the item. So you have to either buy three or you would rather buy four. And then you can use the load to car coupon. And then for the other two, you can use the shop me on rebate. So that's the best way to do it. Just want to let you guys know if you don't have it. Or you can just submit it to shop me on alone if you just have the shop me on. And you just only have two items. So anyway, I had the paper coupon. I was very happy about that. And, you know, it was completely free. All right. Now... The Lysol that you guys can see here, these are all part of the monthly deal. So the Lysol 15 count wet wipes here, those are buy three, get $3 in bonus cash back. This is a monthly deal with a limit of four offers per card. And uh, I was able to find nine of these in the store, so I did take them. And the reason I did it this way, because I have the bonus cash challenge for Lysol. It's a higher value. So it was like, I think $31 and get $4.70. I know it's not that much, but um, I was able to make it work somehow. I hope. <laughs> I don't know. This was a little bit of cost. And then those little to-go Lysol that you guys can see right there, the disinfectant spray, those were $3.99 at my store, buy two, get $4 in bonus cash back. Oh, and these were actually a $2.39 at my store. You can get these, it, actually the prices are very, very, very varied. It's like $1.59 to $2.39 or $2.49, I think, for just these wipes. So it's a very, very, you know, variable amount that you have to pay for this. I think those Lysol canisters are also, you know, between like $3.79 and uh, $4.39, I think. So it's a very, very varied amount so you need to like make sure you check your prices and then come up with some deals with this okay i just want to let you guys know that i don't want to like give you the wrong prices or whatever but you guys need to double check your prices in the store and now that i added all those up unfortunately it was only 29.49 for the nine wipes and the two canisters and i'm kind of a little upset because i was just two dollars away from getting to the 31 dollars mark where i could get the four dollars and 70 cents back in bonus cash challenge so that was a bit of a bummer but whatever i'm gonna have to make this work in my favor anyway otherwise i would lose my bonus cash and then I'm, everyone hears my complaints and you know nobody wants to hear that so i gotta also make sure that i roll my bonus cash so anyway whatever done is done i had an 8 off 40 coupon that i got actually from doing this transaction here i got an 8 off 40 so i decided to go ahead and use it in this transaction and that just you know i had to come up with some kind of scenario to use that 8 off 40 i mean i could have just picked all this up next week and you know saved a lot of money but you know whenever you need to roll the bonus cash you need to start rolling it right so yeah yeah those all those wipes 239 each at my store then the canister was 399 each 362 362 249 249 
Okay, and I only use the 6 off of 2 for the L'Oreal, 5 off of 2 for the Clairol, and 8 off of 40. Alright, my sub total came to $22.71, my tax was $2.23, my total was $24.94 for all those items that you guys can see, and I got back $13 in bonus cash, so let's talk about it. So the $13 came from uh, 3, 6, and 9, and then $4 back for that Lysol that you guys can see in the middle. That's how I got $13 back. So I guess I lost $12 in bonus cash from all this, uh, which is not that great. Um, so yeah, you can take it however you will. <laughs> I'm kind of, I'm kind of a little shocked that I even did this. I don't know why did I do this. Anyway, yeah, I was thinking I was going to get the $4.70 back, but now I'm going to have to buy maybe some other Lysol stuff in order to absorb that cost. So that's fine. It's whatever, whatever happened, happened. Um, next week would have been a better week to do it, but you know, whatever happened, happened now. So it's not all bad. Now, yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of regretting this one, but, you know, I did get, actually, instead of getting, what was it, I was supposed to get, like, 400 points for this transaction, but I actually got back 2,000 Rite Aid Rewards points because it's my grandfather's card. Technically, that's getting back, um, $4 in bonus cash, so I guess instead of paying $12, I kind of paid $8 for all this, so it doesn't hurt as much, I guess, um, but then I'm gonna have to just buy, maybe I'll just find another Lysol for, like, $2 or so, so tacking on the cost of $2, um, I'm estimating to pay $10 and get back $4.70 or just $6 for all those Lysol things. Um, I mean, how many wipes is this technically? 45, 90, um, 135, I think? Yeah, so paying like $5 or so for that much and getting the Lysol and the Clairol, I mean, I guess it's okay. <laughs> It's not all bad, I guess, but you know, it kind of just stings a little bit. So maybe if I just like resell the suave, that will cover the cost of this. So I'm not gonna be like all bad, or, you know, sad about it or whatever. Once I get my Lysol and bonus cash tracking, then that's, you know, that's all I'm gonna work out in the end. So I mean, some people will probably be blessed, you know, they don't have to pay full price for all this stuff, but sometimes this stuff is like, I really don't want to pay for it <laughs> if I don't need to. All right. So anyway, I guess you can take it however you will, $8 right now. And then $10 and then getting $4 and 70 cents back, yeah, $5 and some change for all that afterwards. So we'll see. <laughs> we'll see how it works out in the future. I'll, I'll probably do something about it. All right, the last transaction here, this was actually done on a card that had bonus cash expiring actually this week. I didn't even realize I had $10.35 expiring. So I had to just come up with some really cheap deal um, in order to, you know, roll my bonus cash. So what I did is I just picked up the two suave at $2.99. So this is the shampoo. It's the same deal as the body wash. So... The shampoo was $2.99, and then obviously 50% off will make it a $1.49, so it was like $4.48 for both of them, and I got back $4 in bonus cash. Hopefully you have coupons to make it better. I was just doing this in a rush, so yeah. The lipsticks, they are $2.74 on clearance, so that one actually, yeah, I was going to get back $3 from Ibotta for each bot, um, lipstick, so that's not all that bad. Um, my stock was $9.96, tax was $0.66. Cents. My total was $10.62, and I got back $4 in bonus cash, so that's for the Suave on this other card, and it's a cost of $6.62, but I will get back $6 from Ibotta for the lipsticks, so that's basically all $0.62 cents for all that stuff. I know, something that I don't want to pay for, but, you know, it ended up being that way, but it's okay, I had to roll bonus cash. I would either lose the $10 or lose $0.62, cents. I think I would rather lose $0.62, cents. and I got 100 points back for this, which is only equivalent to $0.20, cents, but, you know, whatever. I think I ended up, you know, doing really well this time around, so, yeah. Um, I guess you guys, if you don't want to go this week, don't go. Probably just save most of these deals for next week. Um, at least the Suave and the hair colors and the Lysol and the lipstick, you know, that can... And actually the Fiji if the rebate doesn't expire, so, you know. I don't know about the coupons for these, though, actually. The L'Oreal and the Clairol, I don't remember the coupons, actually, when they expire. But I know they came in the recent insert, so it probably is going to expire really soon. So it definitely does do a double check. All right, so that's all that I have to say about this. Um... Yeah, I guess next week will be better. Hopefully I can roll my bonus cash better and make money. And that's all that matters. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. And yeah, look out for my ad scan video later for next week because I have a lot to talk about. Bye, everyone.